Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Bayonetta Blind. So in the last episode we made our way into the Ithaval building and so far it's been a non-stop trek of uh, getting our ass pounded, no pun intended. Um, we tested out the new weapons a little bit and so far I'm going to have to take more time to learn how to use them when I'm not in this endgame-ish area with all those super hardcore monsters. But on the bright side, I figured out how to switch between the electric and the fire. Parts the claws, so that's cool. So let's get on, head on forward. Okay, there's nothing up top here, nothing around there. Already. Oh, jeez, I'm outside. Well, those camera angles make that a little bit complicated. Oh, look, there's the moon. All right, let's do this. You won't stop me. All I gotta do is... Oh, well, hi there. Oh, jeez! I was not expecting you. Oh, jeez, I can't... I can't... Ah! Okay. If you give me a second to actually, you know, like... Do something to dodge... Give me a free second, Jesus! Okay, I need to heal. I need to heal right now. Nope, go back. And I am basically out of healing supplies. Yep. You know what? Instead of healing, let's just pop one of these. That'll help. And it's not cheap because it's part of the gameplay mechanics. stuck inside. Alright, let's run. And I think I lost my... Oh, no, I still have my health, uh, my shields. So we're good. Now, I wonder if these thing, these shield uh, lollipops, they last a specific duration of time, or if it's based on how much damage that you take. try to save that last health, so if I die shortly, I'll just accept it. But I think I'm going to need that for the final fight against Jubilus, Jubilius, however. Like, I've seen it, this name tossed around quite a bit, I just, we don't know who he is. Alright, and actually, let's look down this way. Because I did learn that in a lot of these uh, Alfheim portals, after you beat a certain section, you actually have to backtrack to find them. They don't put them either platform... What's the word I'm looking for? They don't put it either in the beaten trap path, off the path, or in a platforming area. They literally throw it back way behind you. Okay, so we got two paths here. There's no telling when the buildings will be destroyed. I have to find sewers quickly. Okay. I am basically dead right now, though. Oh, well, hello there, giant statue. Wait. Rodin! Rodin! Help! Help! I need some health, like right now. <laughs> Please help me. damage those do. What's up, Roden? You really want to make a deal with the devil? 
I'm trying my best not to call him rodent. It's just hard when you're saying it fast. I'm just fucking with you. Alright, let's get some health. Oh, there we go. Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That really doesn't give us that much health. Never mind. And let's just get a red hot shot. Nice. So that'll at least keep us alive for a little bit. Later, buddy. I didn't realize they were so cheap. I could have been purchasing them more throughout the game. Because I was, I was questioning um, about the limited supplies of healing materials, but if you can purchase them for like 2,000 halos each is what it looks like, that's not too bad at all. Alright, there we go. Oh, platforming. Ooh. Well, hello there. Ooh, hello there. I like you. Oh, perfect. More health. I always like more health. Alright, let's jump on up. Alright, anything on that end? Nope, anything on this end? Doesn't look like it. Let's go all the way around just to take a look. Yep. Okay, so it looks like there is a way to drop down on this end for another uh, hidden section, but let's read this off first. Ithaval CEO 1. The Ithafal group holds a complete control of the grid, planning the city and arming it to the teeth, all while using rhetorical flourishes, concealing the conglomerate's many dark facets. The company's vast political and economic power has created an island held as the symbol of modernity, the Isle of Soul, and placed its headquarters at the symbol's very center. At the conglomerate's top stands a man said to be a descendant of the long-departed Lumen, a man who has earned the adoration of the people, Balder. Ah, uh, of course. Balder is, as they say, a myster mystery wrapped in an enigma. If he is truly one of the descendants of the Lumen, that would mean that the blood in his veins has been pumping since their extermination some 500 years ago. However, even if you look back through the decades of Vic Grid's records, there's no knowledge of anyone with the Lumen lineage. Furthermore, if you search for information on his hometown, schooling, work history, or family, you'll find that it all has been forged. There is no record of his life before Ithaval, nor has there been any stories of unimpeachable veracity. It seems like he has been hiding deep of his life ever since his birth. I have already chronicled the unprecedented military expansion and turbulent movements related to the next generation energy research taking place in the grid. However, a man who has for years or even decades hidden the facts of his life is now at the very pinnacle of power of the conglomerate with literally earth-shaking might. The question begs to be asked, what is this man capable of? Alright, let's go ahead and drop down here. Ooh, another one. I like that. Oh, that's right. Come on. Here we go. Get rid of these guys. All the damage. Come on. You got some more? Actually, since we have fire guys, let's see if these work against them. Just out of curiosity. Nope. They do not. Do they do more damage when we're in... And I completely missed them, so yeah, let's just take these off. I'm not gonna mess around with getting my ass kicked right at the moment. You know, just take one out, I don't care, just get rid of it. Oh, but I can use you. Can use their own weapons against them. Is that it? Hey you! Hey you! 
Nice. Are we done? Are we done? Can I move? What are you? Oh! God, there's a birdie! Pick up the birdie! I missed the bird. Is it gonna come back? Yes, it will. Okay. Gotcha. Beautiful. Alright, let's head back up and go climb the statue. Okay, let's turn this guy. I don't know where we're turning this, but let's do it. <coughs> oh, jeez, what's happening here? Oh, dear. Oh, dear. I gotta hurry up. Gosh, just keep running, just keep running. We're good. Whoa! You, wait, what the hell? What am I fighting? Oh, okay. I was gonna say, it looked like we had... Oh, come on. Okay, I'm just gonna wait here until they come back, because it seems like these things fire off really quickly. Come on. Oh, so they don't do anything until I walk near them? Okay. There, there we go. Seriously, go into your fucking bird form. Just move slowly, drop. Go into the bird. Oh, Jesus. Okay, take five. So I kind of have to take the path of these things. Where? Here we are. Okay. Whoa, what's just coming out? Oh god, a golem? Oh Jesus. And I missed completely. Come on, gotta get that down. Oh jeez! This is a different version of this. Don't skip down. Okay, I dodged through that, but okay. Almost down. Oh boy. Okay, stay in the sphere long enough for me to actually hit you. Okay. There we go. Land. And you just missed the entire freaking time. Thank you. Come on. Nice. Nice. Oh, and for some reason this time you decided to do the second attack. Nope. There we go. Get rid of this thing.
let's play some volleyball. Oh, okay, let's go get some chair. Nice. down and in we go okay Ooh, let's continue climbing this tower what is it all right it's this little guy wait is this gonna constantly break underneath me Okay, I can't see where he's at. Okay, go. What the hell? I can't see what I'm doing. I can't fight if I can't see. There's that. Oh. There we go. Just run. I can't see. Yeah, that wasn't... I don't know if that was a very good design on that, because you can't see anything you're doing all the way up. Oh, jeez! Run the other way! Run the other way! I can't move any faster! Oh, okay. You physically can't run that fast. Alright, let's give that a take two. supposed to go up and scare you, but not do anything more after that. Okay. Okay. Man, what is this entire giant ball doing up here? What just happened? Oh boy, I don't know if I want to do this. Is that it? Oh no, I'm falling! Here we go, another one of these sections. All right, we're gonna leave it off here and continue onwards to uh, go through this heavenscape looking place in the next episode. So we'll see you guys then, bye.